Hydrogen is being touted as the energy of the future, clean, abundant and interchangeable with fossil fuels. Or so some people say. Can all this hype possibly be justified? International enthusiasm for hydrogen power has never been greater, particularly for use in heating and transport. But there is a big problem. Producing hydrogen gas without generating CO2 emissions. As it stands, 95% of hydrogen is produced using fossil fuels, mostly methane. If this continues, then unless rapid improvements to carbon capture and storage technology are made, the use of hydrogen will do little to reduce emissions. The alternative, electrolysis, requires enormous amounts of electrical energy, making this exorbitantly expensive and potentially highly emitting. And that's only the half of it. Hydrogen also has some fundamental physical limitations. It is much less dense than natural gas, has to be kept at a lower temperature, and is more volatile, making it a potentially dangerous alternative. It also requires vast quantities of fresh water to produce. The premature adoption of hydrogen as a new source of energy risks saddling Europe and the UK with enormous costs, while producing no tangible benefit for consumers. The old joke is that hydrogen is the technology of the future, and always will be. A new report by energy expert John Constable gives you the vital facts and analysis to make sense of all the latest hydrogen hype. Hydrogen, the once and future fuel, is available to read now on the GWPF website.